Okay, this is my Sky Surfer with the uh, with some LED lighting added to it. Uh, you can see the leading edges have uh, LEDs on them. The uh, underside of the fuselage, uh, at least on the back part of it, has some lights. Uh, so I'll show you in a second how I've got those uh, hooked up. But you can see there on the bottom part behind the landing gear to the back but not on the very tip. You can see it's got some light there. Okay, we're going to turn the lights on now. Okay, so here you can see the lights up close. I'll show you how I have these wired, but basically these are 12 volt um, lights from Hobby King. Um, here's my little contraption um, that I have. Uh, it's connected to my battery, to uh, just between my battery and my speed controller, and I can connect up to four different light uh, lights to it. So what I did was I. Uh, Took this Hobby King that Hobby King light strip, and um, it's got the adhesive 3M adhesive on it, and I just put that on the leading edge of the wing. I figured I could it would be visible from the top or the bottom this way, and then I used just some clear packaging tape over that just to help preserve some of that um, airfoil on the front, um, and then I just soldered a servo connection uh, connector on the end and I just cut out the middle wire um, so I did that for both wings and also for the underside of the fuselage so right now I've got three different light strips okay so this is the little connector that I soldered up you can see this part here plugs into the battery this part plugs into the speed controller and then basically I just have those two red and black wires positive and negative um, wired into this um, this is just four different sets of servo connectors um, females um, and I just cut out the center wire for each of those and then I used a piece of tape just to wire them together. This way I can just, if I decide I don't want to run the lighting, I can just take this whole thing out um, and do that and then I just use some tape to keep it together. So this is just the LED light strip that I ran under the uh, plane, under the fuselage. So I just ran it all the way to the end but I didn't cover it up. The, the very back just so it wouldn't scrape the bottom of the LEDs and then I just let the wire go in underneath the plane so then I just bring these connectors in um, I've got two of them right here for the two wings and then I bring and then I also got one for the under the fuselage and I just connected them in to that um, the little servo connector thing into this thing. So here we are outside. Just wanted to show you that with it all lit up. So should give me pl plenty of light outside. It's pretty bright. You can uh, see it from a pretty good distance. Those stars are there so they can help distinguish the bottom of the plane from the top. Okay, here's my Sky Surfer with LEDs on it. You can see the left wing has red, the right wing has green on the leading edge, and there is also underneath there some white along the bottom. Uh, so it is daylight right now so I'm testing it during the day see how the flight characteristics are and uh, see hopefully this will uh, be more visible and I can fly it at uh, dusk if I need to okay so I got my daughter 
who is filming everything for me. And test it out, make sure everything's working. Okay. to keep your eye on it. Keep it in the picture. Here we go. to the pool. It's going to come right towards us, okay? What do you think of that? Okay, I'm putting on my helmet cam here. Center it right there. Okay, landing wasn't too bad.